Hi, I'm Mitch Fagundes, here to tell you how the Endura IP video system from Pelco makes HD simple. Video analytics can be a powerful tool to provide actionable intelligence from your video security system. But to get the most benefit, you need to make sure that your video analytics software is set up correctly. And that's why Pelco worked hard to make configuring analytics simple and straightforward. Now I'm going to show you just how easy it is to set up analytics on an Endura system. Here's a scene with four different shots from the same building. Now I'm interested here in this trash bin because we don't want unauthorized people entering. What I'm going to do is select Analytics and Modify Analytics. From here, it automatically takes me to the Video Analytics tab where I can see the camera that I'm working on. Now I'm going to add a profile. We'll call this Trash Bin. After I select OK, I come over here to select the analytic that I'm interested in. We have seven different analytics to choose from. Abandoned object, adaptive motion, camera sabotage, directional motion, object counting, object removal, and scene analyzer. We could use directional motion, but since the scene is so busy and outdoors, we're going to use adaptive motion. Since we're going to have moving clouds in the background, we can set that. The background is noisy from those trees that you can see back there. And I think I'm going to turn up the sensitivity just a little bit to 7. We're going to leave the fine tuning at normal and change the alarm severity to major. Now we'll calibrate the scene. If I was looking down a long hallway, I would want to change my perspective. But since I'm not, we're going to leave it the same and I can move to object size. Object size is where I determine what size object will set off my alarm. Since we don't want vehicles setting off the alarm, I'm going to decrease my maximum width to an appropriate size. Once I think it gets down to that point, I can move this line around to help me better determine if I've selected the right size. If I need to adjust it, I can easily do that from these squares here. Now I'm going to set my minimum height. We want people setting off this alarm, so we might want to increase that minimum height just a little bit. Now that I've set my maximum width and minimum height, I can come back and actually draw the zone I'm interested in. We have the choice of a line or polygon, and I'm going to do this with a polygon, because I'm interested in people not only going into the front of the dumpster, but also jumping over the back. When I click, it'll drop a point. If I click again, it'll drop a second and a third point. And on the fourth point, when I double click, it will actually close my box. Now that my detection zone is configured, I can choose which direction I want to get alarms from. Since people can enter from the front or the back, I want to select all. I'm going to verify that my zone alarm is enabled. Once my analytic is all set up, I can click apply to save my changes and then OK to take me back to my video window. From here, I want to see how my analytic looks. I can go to Analytics, Show Analytics, which will show me the zone, and this little blinking dot here shows that the analytic is actually learning the scene right now. Once it's done, our analytic will be fully functional, and we should be able to receive alarms. Immediately after our analytic was set up, we started receiving actionable events from the system. If you'll notice this gentleman here, walking over and loitering in the parking stall. He's not doing anything wrong at this point, so we don't want an alarm for this event. He's obviously waiting for something. Once this other person passes, he goes straight for the dumpster, and as soon as he enters, the zone is activated, and you'll notice it turns red, sending us an actionable alarm, letting us know that anything we missed was actually caught by the system. Now that our security personnel have been notified of the unauthorized access, they can dispatch the appropriate personnel to the scene. And that's how easy it is to set up analytics on an Endura system. The Endura IP video system, HD made simple. To learn more, contact your dealer or visit us online at pelco.com IP.